we're going to start out with uh, easier multiplications called scalar multiplication. So you pick uh, you have a, a real number called a scalar and an n by m matrix. So what does an n by m matrix look like? It has n rows, m columns. So here's row one, row two, all the way down to the last row would be row n. So if you think of the subscripts, the first subscript's the row, the second one's the column. It's a little weird because the first subscript is how far vertically you're gonna go, and the second one is how far horizontally. So it's sort of the opposite of graphing, unfortunately. Usually the first coordinate we think of as x is the horizontal, but these are just opposites. So just think in row, column. So go down uh, the rows here, you're in the nth row, first column. And if you're up here, you're in the first row, second column, first row, third column, all the way down to first row, m column. And last entry down here, you're in the column, you're in row n, column n, row, column. How do you multiply? You just take the scalar and you multiply it across every single entry in here. Think about it as distribution. So it's alpha times this entry, alpha times that entry, alpha times every single entry in your matrix. You just distribute the scalar. These are equal, so you could undistribute the scalar. You could think of that as factoring the scalar back out. So what we're gonna do now is do some scalar multiplication combined with addition. These are not very difficult operations. We're just gonna be putting them together here. So I'm just rewriting this with A and B. So remember we are going multiplication before we do addition. So I need to multiply, multiply before I add or subtract. I'm gonna multiply the negative two in here. We have negative two, negative four, zero, negative six, plus negative three, negative six, three, three. And they have the same dimensions, two by two. So we're gonna add negative two plus negative three is negative five. Negative four plus negative six, negative 10, there's a lot of negatives. And zero plus three is three, negative six plus three, negative three. So this is our uh, answer to uh, finding negative two A plus three B. So. Do your multiplication first, your addition second.